Hello. Steel Crown Dances. Set my timer. And we're back with more of this Dollar Tree haul. And this bag is ripped to hell. That's all I can say. Got another bag of these uh, uh, tortillas. I like these. These are really good. I think I'm going to have a turkey taco night. I've got some ground turkey. Uh, so I might make some turkey tacos. Oh, I got uh, two packs of this. Um, it's the Heat and Eat Kicking Beef and Bean Chili Good Eats by Good Eats. All natural, 15 ounce. And, uh, yeah, I, I mean, I know a person could get two servings out of here. And, uh, and you could always put this and make chili dogs, too, you know, and or chili and whatever. So, yeah, so I got two of them. So I noticed in my last video I was thinking, I was holding things up too close to the camera and it, the quality wasn't too good. I never know right where to go with it. Uh, my other jar of Piccarellis. So, and this bag, I think, uh, yeah, I think this bag's pretty much so. Yep, I think it's a goner. I think I'm not going to put this jar back in there, that's for sure. Because I would have a big old mess to clean up. And I'll put these in another bag. Because I don't need a big mess. I was so happy. Oops. Well, finally, I found... These, and they had quite a few for once. I found the uh, Velveeta cheese sauce, the original in the four ounce. And I brought six bags, six bags of it, because this is a nice size to have to put. Well, you could put over chili dogs, you could put it over broccoli, cauliflower, um, stuff like that so yeah I was tickled pink finally and they had plenty of it but I got six packs because it's like I've been wanting this for so long I finally got it so I was really happy about that one okay let's see everything's falling out of the sacks this one next though Okay. More of the old London all natural Melba snacks in uh, the sea salt. And they didn't have the bagels. I heard they're supposed to be the little bagel chips, but. And I didn't find the uh, plantain. Yeah, the plantain chips. I wanted a pack of them. And then I got one of the Melba snacks and the sesame. And then I got a um, herb and garlic marinade. Uh... It's uh, ready in 10 minutes. It's a uh, 12.25 fluid ounce, and it's a herb and garlic marinade to marinate your uh, meat in. I haven't seen that before. So that sounded really good. Oh, and I didn't find the new steak sauce out neither. Didn't find that. But I mean, I'm not complaining. I found a lot of things today, so I was really happy. I got another bottle of the uh, Riverton Valley 
Italian dressing, uh, 16 ounce. They didn't have any decent sized bottles of blue cheese and I've got plenty of ranch. Oh, and then I got uh, a bag of that New England country soup and the Yankee white bean. That sounded good. And then I got two cans of the Bumblebee Check Light Tuna and Water. The spirit won't eat tuna. He won't eat fish. I catch all this fish. That cat won't eat a single bite of fish. And I'm a fisher person. And I catch fish. And uh, yeah, he won't eat it. But he will drink because um, I like to make tuna salad. So I save the little broth and I put it in a bowl for him. He'll drink every bit of the broth. It's a treat to him. But he won't eat the tuna. If I put tuna down, no. Mm -mm. But he will drink the broth. And then for my fur babies outside, because I have like a great amount of all kinds of fur babies. Peanuts. And some feathered friends. The bluebirds like the peanuts. <laughs> and my squirrels are so spoiled. I've got a little black squirrel and I call him Bear because they know their names because they upset babies. And he will just pose and like strike a poses and when I talk to him and he's such a ham. I'm telling you. So I got, um, I thought this was pretty nice. It's like a good sized bag of, it's salted. It, oh, good lord. Sorry guys. Upside down. It's the Hampton Farms. Salted roasted peanuts. 10 ounce. So it's a good sized bag. So I was like, okay, well, um, I'm going to pick up some peanuts. So I got two. Two of these. For my fur babies out some. I have, um, I have a tremendous amount of wildlife. I could actually qualify to be a sanctuary, a wildlife sanctuary. The only problem I have is I don't have enough wildflowers yet um, to do it. I have enough wildlife. Um, and I have, it's so funny. I have, uh, I have, um, a woodchuck that came to me last year and this bag's about ready to rip too and um, this uh, summer he um, brought a lady friend so I do and now I have little woodchucks it is so adorable. I mean, they're just so cute. And um, I named the male when he came to me. He's been with me the longest over the last couple of years, actually. Um, I named him Chucky. And then I named the female Chuckette. And then um, the baby Chipper. So, yeah, I've got... Uh, oh, just a tremendous amount of wildlife different species you know and it's like okay I'll get on with this next bag but I got everything is just falling out oh my goodness here we go yeah I've got um, deer and um, what do you call them? Uh, raccoons. I have two different species of woodpeckers. I have all of the, I have like the ravens, the big ones that are huge, and crows, and blackbirds, and sparrows, and blue jays, and cardinals, and two different species of woodpeckers. I have owls. Um, 
I just have so much going on out there. Sometimes I feel like Snow White. I got two of these just to repurchase. The Sweet Mate 100 packets. Um, I get these two every month. And then this bag just has, yeah, this is all of my Coffee Make Coffee Creamer, which is, there's five of them, which is a repurchase, the original powder, uh, well, oh, there it is, sits out. So I get this every month. I was tickled this month. I got some new stuff to show you guys. That, uh usually doesn't happen it really usually doesn't and then i got um three of the pringles the original um 5.68 ounce of pringles oh i don't want to knock this jar off i better get this in a bag too I'll put it in this one oh, that bag's in better shape Okay. <coughs> Sorry, guys. I just want to get a couple of these things so I don't forget them because I don't want to make 20 trips back and forth to get them put up and then come back and find out I've got three things so set in here. Okay. Oh, we're fine. Um, metal arm. Okay. I got lucky. This is the only non-food that I got. And I was just tickled, tickled, tickled to find. I got three. Some of these scarves. I was so excited. It's like, yay! Isn't that gorgeous? The animal print, but it's like blue, purple, pink, red, orange, yellow, green, blue. Isn't that beautiful? I just love, I love color. I mean, I just love, love, love color. Isn't that beautiful? So I got one of them. And then I got... One of these with the stars and hearts. Isn't that pretty? So pretty. And then I got, um, I love this one with the smiley faces and the peace signs and the hearts and stars and flowers. Yep, got this one. So gorgeous. So pretty. Um, because I only made it down really two, two food aisles and what past the freezer section because I didn't take my wheelchair because I knew there probably wouldn't be room in the car. Um, and then I I made it that down two aisles of groceries and past the freezer section. And then I my back was really starting to bother me, but I wanted to go by the stationery to see. Because I'm looking for that thing that um, you put up by post-its on your home collection. You put on your fridge that holds the little uh, post-its. You know, I got the post-it refills, but I still can't find that that thing, and I really want one. Um, so, um, yeah, and um, yeah, they they didn't have anything and I even took a glance at the stickers because I, I see some of this food stickers hauled like the birthday cakes and that and I want some food stickers and you now they didn't have nothing and um, I had to go then you know but I was happy that I 
I walked, I kind of had to lean on the cart a little bit, but, uh, and, and that, but I didn't make it through, but that was this, these were at checkout, the scars were, uh, cause I know they always keep them at this particular location, right up by the checkout as you, you saw, it's like, mm -hmm. got my scars, but I couldn't do any other looking cause, um, I was done. It's like, I'd had all I could handle. Well, at any rate, that ends my grocery haul for Dollar Tree. And um, I will be back with starting my Baker's haul. Well, Baker's, Dillard's, someplace it's known, not Dillard's, Dillon's, Dillon's, and someplace it's Kroger. But it's all the same store. But here we call it Baker's. So, um... It's like they couldn't make up their mind and what they wanted to call their store, I guess. I don't know. But it's, um, I got a nice haul. Got a lot of manager specials. I was really happy about that. Alright guys, so we'll see you at the Baker's Hall. Later.